Hey guys, coming to you from the Bowery Warehouse, the home in Perry Designs. And I thought I would show you guys a couple of fun projects. Um, so I hope everybody's okay, by the way. Um, I know for me, anytime I can get my hands on flowers, um, I'm as happy as I can be and I feel creative. And I can, for a few minutes, kind of forget everything that's going on out there. Um, I'm sending all my love all my massive support to the amazing first responders, doctors, nurses who are out on the front lines. I know everybody keeps saying this, but we can't say it enough. Like, you guys are amazing. The stories coming out are crazy. So, let's go beyond that. Let's uh, do something fun. So, I love tropical leaves. They are so impactful and can create such a wow moment that I thought I would show you some fun things I've been doing. So back in January, I did an amazing event for Bell Flight in Dallas, and I painted, oh, I don't know, what seemed like thousands of leaves in a very cold warehouse with heaters on me and massive mask, which I did have on when I was painting earlier. Um, and I really had a good time doing it. Um, there's all kinds of fun things that you can do with paint and um, I'm only gonna show you a couple of things. I think I would love to kind of do maybe another video with some more kind of bizarre painting techniques I've had fun with um, on painting on these tropical leaves. But for now, I just thought I'd show you the basic. Um, first of all, I think you guys, most of you know, this is a monstera leaf and you can see why it's called Monstera. They are monstrous, they are huge. This is probably called a large one. You can get extra large, which would basically take you beyond the screen that you can see. They go down to pretty small ones as well. These are amazing leaves to paint on. Also, other good leaves are banana plant leaves, bird of paradise leaves, anything with that really great flat surface. But palm leaves do beautifully as well. Like I said, if you'll go to my Instagram stories and go to the one called Summit Dinner, you can see some of the different ways we painted leaves and how much fun we had with it. But I just wanted to show you how you could take two leaves, and these will be available starting tomorrow morning, Thursday, April 30th uh, and come up with a really fun wow impact for your home with just a little bit of work and not very much money. So remember one or two monstera leaves can get you some awesome wonderful things like this. I've done two different kinds of paint techniques on those. Um, this one I'm loving it's this beautiful kind of I hope you can see it kind of spa blue but what I've done on the back side is a lighter, which is hard to tell, but it's a lighter blue. I love how when the light will catch it underneath, it will kind of refract some light. Um, so I love that. I also have had a really good time playing with matte versus gloss finishes. Um, I think it's really fun to play with your colors. Um, I'm kind of really digging this color scheme. I don't know if you can see it, it's kind of blending with the background, but it's this really yummy kind of terracotta orange with this blue. Loving that. And then I'm gonna take these leaves down and show you what I did with them. Thank goodness for glue dots. So this one, I'm gonna play more with this concept, but I really wanted to have this kind of Mond Mondrian, which is a painter who did these really wonderful um, kind of geometric designs in his paintings. I didn't quite get there with this one, so don't take that against me. But I was going to use three different colors, and I just basically used a piece of cardboard or a piece of cardstock. And as I painted, I just held it there and kept going until, you know, I was behind myself in the painting, if that makes a sense. So I would start here and paint and then I would put it down and paint that, and then I would cover this, and then cover that, and paint that that way. So I know I'm really kind of looking forward to playing with this concept of different colors within a leaf. Um, if you'll see on the back side, I just did it in white, and I'm sorry, but the little pops of color came out because I'm playing with it and it's still wet, and you shouldn't do that, by the way. You should let them dry, and the easiest way to do that is stick them in a bucket, or somewhere outside where they can just get dry really quick. And the great thing about Monstera leaves, any of your tropical leaves, especially the big ones like this, they're really super thick stemmed and very fleshy. 
and they will grab that water and bring it all the way up. They'll last for weeks. And I painted these when I first started playing with them in January. Um, and it was in a warm house that had heat on and they lasted for about four and a half, five weeks. So it's pretty fun in a pretty good way. Now this other one, I really love this color too. This is this kind of really beautiful teal blue. And then on the back side, I did a copper, which, oh, how yummy is that? Um, love that. And then I also kind of had fun, I don't think you can see it that way, just brushed a little bit of copper on the edges of the leaves to kind of get it, it kind of gives it movement that way. I think it's like really super interesting. Um, one of the things I'm also playing with is getting it to kind of marble and that you do that with playing with water as you paint. So I'll do that one in another video. But I just wanted to bring you guys this really quick, tell you that you could get your leaves at Fiesta Foods on Western starting tomorrow, April 30th. I think I have the right date. Also, if anyone's interested, I have a million of these beautiful tall blue vases, which I think you can see. Literally one to two leaves make such a really cool story that you can have fun with. Um, and you can see that I actually like this color with this. So just loving something like that as a big, huge wow piece in your home somewhere. Just something fun and colorful. Um, and you can do that with two leaves. So that's it for now. I'm Perry with Perry Designs, offering Perry Blooms at Fiesta Foods. Hope to see you soon. Thanks guys, bye-bye.